show 109% by shading. So just as a bit of a review, 109% if we were to write it out would literally be 109% per cent, per cent, which is the same thing as 100 and which is the same thing as 109 per per and I could write cent again but that's getting old. Cent means 100. So it literally means 109 per 100. Per 100. If you had 100 per 100 you're dealing with the whole, but now we have more than a whole. We have 109 per 100. We can actually write this as a ratio or as a fraction. This is the same thing as 109 per 100. It's the same thing as 109 over 100. So let's shade that in. So we have a whole here. So we could consider this square a whole. In the last video, we counted. There's This is a 10 by 10 square. It is cut up into 100 pieces. So if we want 109 of those 100 pieces, what are we talking about? Well, that means we're going to shade in all of the 100 right over here. Let me do that in a new color. So we'll shade in all of this. We'll shade in all of this right here. That would be, if you just shaded that in, that would be 100%. That would be 100 over 100, or 100 per 100, or 100 per cent. I, hope, I, I think you're getting the meaning of, of all of this here. I just don't want you to just memorize the steps. This really just means 100 out of 100, or a whole. And you can see that this is the whole square. That's 100 out of 100 right there. The question is saying, show us 109% by shading. So we, have to, we already did 100 per 100, but we need to do another 9. So let's shade in another 9. So we, now we have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So this piece right here, you could almost view that as, well, that is. That is 9%. That is 9% of an entire square. This is 100% of an entire square. If you consider this whole thing plus this blue area right over here, you are talking about 109% of this of one whole square. Hopefully that made sense.